It's been a uh, busy start to trials. We're obviously uh, probably in that midpoint now. This week starts out with everyone doing their small boats generally um, and then the juniors doing their grading races and then it starts to get a bit nastier for the athletes and a bit more difficult for us. Yeah, so the selection panel has been working really well. Uh, it's been a really positive experience. There's been a number of uh, meetings leading into this. We have to start making some decisions about who's going to row with who and comparing athletes and telling some athletes unfortunately that they're no longer required for trialling which is always difficult. I mean, of course you have something in mind when you come into the role, but trying to meet the coach's expectations and more importantly the athlete's expectations, it sort of makes you realise just how special this role is and how seriously you have to take it. Yeah, it, it, it's a great thing for the sport and for the processes to be able to be um, a formal part of that process now. Uh, I think probably fair to say I had some role previously, but now it's actually been clearly articulated that I'm officially now a, a selector with the other guys. Basically, we're all pretty equal on the panel and we get an equal say and we run it like a democracy and ideally we get, we get a 3-0 vote on the decisions we make. Um, to help people uh, you know, make their dreams come true. I, I guess that's that's what what makes this job worthwhile. All three people are good people. Um, they desperately want to pick really good and high performing crews for the country, uh, and also support young people through their journey um, of rowing for Australia.